little sugar buggers. Welcome back to the channel. So today we're doing a different kind of like CC shopping video. It's not even really a shopping video. It's more like a CC holy grail discovery slash create a shout out sort of shindig. I don't know. Anyway, what I'm going to go ahead and show you guys is some pretty freaking sweet Maxis matched hairs and recolors. So I was on one of my like Twitter forum chat room things and I was just you know <laughs> lurking as I always do and I saw somebody post like a picture of this particular hair um, I'm not exactly sure which one that it was I think it's you know it was this hair here it was like frazzy simming and then um, I was like hold the phone <laughs> like somebody better hold that poodle girl because what is this a mop on her head because I need to I need to snatch that weave two times so I asked um, like where it, where where is this masterpiece from and um, Kayla actually went ahead and gave me the link to this website little crisps which I just love the name and um, basically what little crisps does or cri gosh it's hard for me to even say her name but what she does is she like recolors hairs and stuff like that and um not to make all of the like attention on her because these hairs as they stand even without being recolored are pretty freaking awesome but if you're like me and you really want to kind of stick with more of like how the game was meant to be and not get those high poly count um super detailed hairs that just don't really look like they fit in the game then you will love little crisps because she does um she takes the the maxis made max maxis matched hairs and like puts them on steroids and <laughs> she makes them um even even better looking or not even necessarily better but maybe just a new look do you get what i'm saying because i actually sometimes in some of these hairs i actually preferred the original creators versus her recolor but it's just nice to have a lot of different options and colors and be able to play around and um kind of get more uh, looks out of the same hair if you get what I'm saying um, so what I'm gonna do is just go ahead and actually take you guys in to create a sim to show you the hairs that I downloaded and again I downloaded all of these um, so as you can see there's a whole bunch of different types of hairs um, we've got some like girl next door looking hairs or innocent hairs we even got some movie hangout recolors which you guys would probably like um, and then some other like uh, type of recolor Hair thingamajiggers. Um, <clears throat> the first page she doesn't actually have a lot up, but um, for what she does have, it's actually pretty pretty awesome. So, and then I don't know if I mentioned this, but I think that I did. Um, she does indeed link you to the original creators as well, so you guys can download the meshes. So, um, one of my favorite hairs that I really loved was this one. Um, I loved the ponytail. I loved this hair too. I'm always looking for some more different types of braids, you know, for ethnics sims or just sims that I want to have like a braided hair look and um, I noticed that a lot of like high poly count hairs they just don't I don't know sometimes they just don't do it for me so I really loved this hairstyle in particular so I think that's enough kind of like you know boasting about um, this page I think what I like the most is that it's so laid out nice and I found like a bunch of cool hair so I'm gonna just go ahead and jump into Cass and show you guys what they look like in game all right so here we are we're just gonna use Babs as a guinea pig and if you guys are wondering where is all of my CC again with the previous CC shopping you guys thought it was just so much easier to focus on what we had just downloaded instead of having my full mods folder kind of installed in displaying so that is why some things may be missing and also a few meshes may not be working because they are not currently present in my game because I just downloaded the recolors I didn't download the entire thing do you know what I mean because I already had it so <laughs> all right so let's go start off with some of the stuff that we picked up um, you're gonna notice the the icons are very um, very prominently displayed the ones with just the um, kind of like your gray hair or whatever like the white hair is the ones that we had downloaded from L little crispy or little crisps I think is what her name was so that it's just an easier way to like know who the recolors from or whatever the situation is does that make sense probably not never does but um, I'm just kind of seeing how far up this goes so we'll start off with the first hair here I think this is the one by the original creator and it just has like all the basic like Maxis hair colors and then this one here is the one by Little Crisps I think it actually may be a little bit different um 
I think that it is. I think it's this one. Okay, so this is actually the original. And then what is this? Okay, the original, the, the recolor. Okay, I'm sorry. And uh, with hers, I've noticed she just has like natural hair colors. Um, she doesn't really do anything super duper duper crazy. And that is why it is kind of cool to have like the original creators as well, if you guys can kind of tell. So there is that one. This one's like, this is, this feels like the game of like go, not go fish. What is it? Like the one where you have to have the cards on the floor and then you have to like match them. I don't know what the hell the game's name is. But anyway, um, here is this hair. That's the original creator. It kind of has like a short, it's like a, how do you say? It's like an inverted bob, right? I think so. We're not inverted. I think it might be. I don't know, or A-line? I have no idea. <laughs> Apparently, I'm not really good at describing things today. So here's the recolor by Little Crisps. It's hard to tell like the huge differences between the two when you don't have like similar color palettes, but you guys can kind of get the general idea. So here's the original um, hair color, and then this is the one by Little Crisps. You can kind of tell a little bit with the difference there, but maybe I'll just do gray, and then you can see the gray here. It's a little more um, natural looking. I guess, versus, you know, the original Maxis hairstyle. So there is that. And then um, this hairstyle here, I do believe, is like the one from the girls section. I don't know, babs, what happened to your brows, girl? They're green. All right, so let's try to get those back to normal. There we go. It doesn't have to be perfect, but hey. Um, so this is this one, and I do believe this was like a children's hair conversion. And then we have it up here, which I freaking think it is so damn gorgeous. I love it. It's like perfect. Um, what else do we have here? Okay, so we have this um, little like pony hairband sort of deal. And I'll express something to you in just a second. And here it is with like a, a pony braid. <laughs> Ponytail braid, yeah, okay. And then we have the buns, which I freaking am in love with. My anaconda don't want none unless you've got buns, huh? Yeah, it's just inappropriate. But yeah, what else? welcome to my channel. What else is new? So with the recolors by, I think, um, we'll just call her crisps. Uh, in the accessories section, you can actually go in, I think, through hats it is, and you can pick up the headband. Or it might be actually the original creator. I'm not 100% sure. And you can go in and change the headband. That is a big issue with a lot of the um, hairstyles I download that have accessories kind of pre-built in is that I can't ever change the color of the headband because you wouldn't really want like a red headband with a blue shirt. You know what I mean? Or maybe you would, but if you didn't, you have the option to go ahead and kind of change that up. Um, and there we have like a bigger ponytail. Um, a smaller one with bangs and the cool thing is just there's so many options that these creators give you so you can always kind of pick and choose and um, you know just decide what you want to put into your game so here is that uh, this hairstyle also is really freaking awesome and they come without the headbands too so if you're not really into that kind of look you can always go ahead and switch it up these freaking hairstyles rock my socks and for some of you you probably already know about all this but in case you're a late bloomer like myself no really though true story um this is going to be something that's going to make your day especially if you're really into like hair so this is the one that I'm loving just because it's so different unlike any Thing I've ever seen before and I feel like it's a style that I'll really take advantage of in my game um this hairstyle too is also another that I really really love um we have this one with kind of like her hair maybe pulled back behind her ears and everything honestly just looks so legit like as if you know EA created it themselves so this is a hairstyle I actually seen Christina with one of her sims wearing and I could never find it uh, it has the same kind of ponytail look as we had seen earlier but a big big chunk of hair kind of pulled out to frame the face and honestly like I said it literally looks so legit it's so legit I just can't quit and then here is the recolor of it as well um, I wish there was maybe some more like natural quote unquote colors like um, the red thing. I think red is a pretty like I, I don't know. Maybe that's not natural, but I don't know. I don't know. I do like it though. Um, here is another hairstyle that's also really freaking cute. It's like the little half um, half up do with a bun and like shorter kind of layers. I think that's actually about it, you guys. Um, we also have the Ariana Grande one that kind of I have, but the mesh isn't 
you know, installed because I have it originally. And I think it's the same with this one. Um, I do actually have these in my regular mods folder. So don't think I forgot because I honestly didn't. Oh, here is another hairstyle that I think a lot of you are absolutely just going to be lusting over. Um, this is the original creator. I don't really know your name, but goodness gracious, absolutely freaking creative. I love this. I have tried so many braided hairstyles and they just don't look as authentic as one would hope like this one and this one literally look like they could have been from the same pack and I think this is the hairstyle with the braids that kind of goes over uh, maybe from get together possibly I'm not exactly sure don't quote me on that but I do believe that it is and then they kind of just made it work so some really cool different types of creations here. And as you can tell, this hairstyle will fit on any type of sim. I love it. So I think that's pretty much it about for bleh, for this, uh, whatever we're going to name this video. Um, I will definitely link the website that I was mentioning in the, um, whatchamacallit, the... Oh, the description down below um, if you guys are interested in checking it out. There may be also a little post about it on my website in case you guys wanted to go take a peek. And I think that is about it. So, yeah. All right, guys. I'm going to go ahead and roll on out. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to go ahead and comment, rate, and subscribe. And let me know what you guys think in the comments down below where the sun doesn't shine. And I will see you all next time. Bye, guys.